It doesn't feel good. Because guys, look at what it weighs. next we have to go down there but i don't know what's coming next maybe that way up we have never been here guys so we have no idea i don't like this trail go wide because you have to turn do the same no i'll do a three point turn up there i'm good okay You have to get used to it. I don't want to get used to it. We're going home and adding my spray bars back. Personal feelings while I wait for everyone else to do what I just did. This trail is a mind threat. That's literally why it's called that. And it got me, guys. My mind is threatened. Driver over here, you drop this hole a little bit. It's not bad because we have clearance. And then you'll drop. I'd go right up that crack right there. And I'll take it high. So something because I'm in a bus. Back and forth. Yeah, it looks fine to me, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. That face, babe. <laughs> We're flying. We're gonna kill this trail. We'll be on to another. I don't know. Yeah. The words flying and kill should not really be used in this okay. connotation. Well, because guys, look at what awaits. <laughs> yeah, if you slide, look look at this, guys. You're going you're going like this, going hold, down. Hold, hold. And Ready? if you slide, you can't tell. I wouldn't go down there and look up. That's not the better view of the video. I warned you. I warned you. Hold on, I'm almost there. It's like a pot. You're checking both angles, but this that one's gonna be worse. It ain't good. <laughs> it ain't good. That's what I have to say. It ain't good. None of it. Three thumbs up. There's like a luna-sized hole right under where you're standing. Like if I laid like this, I fit. This is bad. But if my bus of a four-door JKU on just 40s can go ahead and fit through here, your lovely two-door 42s will just glide. Yeah. Glide. All right. Well, we'll, we'll see some gliding soon, guys. Okay, stand right next to these so people can see how deep that hole is. So you shoot it, shoot it from down there. Yep. <gasps> just don't pre- I'm don't. so nervous, I have to be. Hey, if Jesse can do it. Yeah, but that school bus is gonna be way more solid than... Okay, keep coming. I know. Looks great. Hey, uh, I wouldn't be there if, if just in case you have to send it. She's going right into there. Let's be 
careful. They're fine. It's going to stabilize now. Turn this way. That's ah. it. Just keep it like that. You're fine. There's nothing there. God, I'm going to throw up. Like that. You sure? Straight down. There's nothing there. Straight down. I know, I trust you, but my body doesn't want to trust you. There's nothing there. Does it feel like it? Oh, I'm going to cry. Oh. That's it. You're down. general consensus seems to be that that was awful. I don't like those rear tires there. Oh, he's doing great. Great speed and everything. So this next part I'm told is pretty mild compared to what we've been doing. So let's see how Jesse does it. Don't know if I would come into it like that. Yeah. So when I walked kind of halfway down it, I saw two lines. To the right, if you just kind of put your uh, passenger tire here and go straight down, that's like the easier. And then to the left is the bigger drops.
not having rear sway bars really changes everything. The Jeep handle, handles differently. Um, the body roll is very weird now. Um, not weird, but there's a lot of body roll, so it feels weird to me. Um, yeah, I don't know if this is necessarily the trail that I wanted to do uh, without sway bars for the first time, but here we are, guys. Here we are. After an awesome day of wheeling, that trail was terrifying but fun. We're here at Holly from Mr. Maker TV's shop. We're gonna help her move the Scottish hammer. I know that if you guys have been following along in her videos, you've seen that she has been organizing the shop. So we're gonna help her move the Scottish hammer so she has room to do the rest of her stuff. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, it's her. Oh, my goodness. She's trying to leave, but the, can you open the bay higher? Yeah. So I'm not even entirely sure how to explain what has currently happened, but Whoa. this bird, this dove just flew in and she or he has been trying to escape out of the, this window. Her head dead. Yeah, poor thing. This and Marlon just went up there and grabbed her. So gently. Yeah, Marlon the bird man. <laughs> All right, far away from the door, like, Go around the corner, Marlon. Around the corner. No, Marlon. Around the corner. Over there. I don't know where a corner is. There you go. She's good. No, Watch she's her hit. Into something else. That's not our fault. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, she that hit was that actually right incredible. You just like, you went hop, upstairs two by two, walked casually. Just, it's okay, baby bird. <laughs> Yeah. That was In case you haven't seen Nessie, here it is. Okay, let's do a cold star. It's going to be loud. Today is simple. We're just going to clear out this corner in the back, which we previously cleared out when we moved the Jeep to the lift. But we're going to need the lift now to work on the giveaway Jeep, which needs to be done by like late May. So we only have a couple of weeks to build it. Um, so we got to get it on the lift and start working on it immediately, which means the YJ project has to go on. Okay, what axles are those? Heavy ones. Heavy duty ones. I'm not exactly sure what happened because I only supervised and we have all of our fingers, no one got hurt, so OSHA's happy. And 